This lady made an unlikely friend while exploring an abandoned house. Abandoned houses may give you a feeling of adventure or might be enough for freaking you out. There are many abandoned places in the outskirts of towns. Personally, I feel the same of being in some old building and feeling it by its silence, though it might spook many people out. Having said that, we have this story for you that you will enjoy. It's a story of a girl named Leslie who had this similar spirit exploring new things. Be sure to subscribe to Did You Know and hit the bell so you never miss an upload from us. Also, leave a like right now. Leslie's instinct of exploring has had great impact on her life. Check out this video to see the unexpected friend that she made and how he has changed her life for excelling. Leslie was wandering one fine day when she came across a rattled looking house. The roof was almost collapsing and the yard was full of overgrown plants. She thought of it as abandoned and decided to find out for herself by having a look inside. She turned inside the house where she saw a man standing whose name is Lawrence. This house is actually his home. He has cataracts infecting his left eye and the right one is completely missing. You can imagine how hard it is for the old man to get around, so he prefers staying home and spends most of his time alone at home. Despite the fact that Leslie had broken into the old man's house, the old man appeared to be very humble and polite. They both sat for a couple of hours, talking about all the struggles Lawrence had been throughout his life due to his impaired condition. Leslie felt an attachment to the old man, and so she decides to see him on a regular basis. She even brings him food and drinks at times. This picture was taken a week before Lawrence suffered a stroke. As a result, he couldn't move his hand. During the meals and visits in the five days when he was seeking medical attention, he opened up more to Leslie by telling her how a bull fractured his hip in 2000, which started a thread of injuries followed by making Lawrence incapable of taking care of himself. He also told about the brother whom he had lost contact with and he also acknowledged Leslie to be a blessing in disguise. The dinner dates continued on for a while, and pizza was the favorite both enjoyed having. In due course, Leslie helped Lawrence clean his yard and fix his house up. Volunteers assisted by removing the old fridge, chest freezer, and stove out. They even removed all the garbage bags, which were many in numbers. Lawrence was extremely filled with gratitude when he knew that finally, he had freed up space in his home. However, Lawrence's health began deteriorating day by day, and he asked Leslie to help him with the arrangements for the funeral, and he also asked her to be there at the time. After suffering his last stroke, he stayed at two different hospitals, being carefully administered. Luckily, he is convalescent and is now living in a retirement home. Lawrence does miss his home, however, he is happy of having people around him. He becomes delighted when Leslie and her dog show up. Here, he is seen with a cake that Leslie's mother had baked for him. This truly appears to be an inspirational story. I would have thought of it as an uninhabited house or would not have listened to the story of the old man. However, there are people with bigger hearts just as Leslie who completely transformed the life of Lawrence and gave him reason to live on. She brought back happiness in Lawrence's life and he has always shown appreciation for the kind gesture displayed by Leslie. What are your thoughts, guys? Did the story inspire you? Do let us know in the comments section below.